Hi everyone and welcome to this tutorial. In this tutorial, I want to show you or demonstrate for you the main application that our course is based on. So, uh, so while I'm explaining you the UI and the course and everything in the course actually, I was referring to this application. Of course, the final output is very similar to this application and check it in the next tutorial but also I want to demonstrate for you this application. This application is available uh, on sale. I will make a separate tutorial regarding this uh, if you want it, so you can get it and uh, get the license for it. So the UI is uh, almost the same as uh, the final output of our application. Maybe the padding, uh, there is slightly different things, but I showed you in the course how to change it and uh, I explained everything in details, but this application, it has more features. It has features like uh, the ratings, ratings for the products. It will uh, be shown like that. So as you can see, I can edit uh, my rating in here if I want. So it has uh, a lot of, uh, of different features. And regarding these features, because I consider them very advanced, uh, I will make a separate tutorial regarding this. But if you want this application now, you can get it. You can get it by sending me a message on my Facebook page. And I said I'll uh, make another tutorial regarding this, but what I meant is that I will create another course that it will be based on this course just to cover the expert stuff such as uh, these kind of orders or the ratings and some other stuff. Okay, I will talk about it separately in another tutorial. So now let me demonstrate for you this application. So first of all, um, just as our application and here is the UI we have the latest arrival browsing by category the user will be able to, to, to browse by category for example if you want like that just show how it belongs to the to the fonts category maybe my mistake so uh, here is the latest arrival the user can be able uh, to search we are showing the ratings in here we are uh, showing the ratings like that if the user didn't rate uh, the product it will be shown like that um, it says here, for example, the user didn't purchase this item and the item is not rated at all yet. Okay, so the, uh, since I purchased this item, the rating will be uh, something like that. See, and if I add a rating, it will be directly shown. Let's say um, hello, for example, submit. And then, as you can see, I have it like that here if I want to edit my rating and here the ratings it will be shown like that and it will appear like that okay if i change this one put it to like that it will be one directly so uh, now the user of course will be able to add to his cart and it's uh, we are saving it on the firestore of course the user can delete and uh, clear his cart and we can change the quantity and to change the quantity we are saving it also on the firestore this is not covered in this course. I would only cover it in the expert course, how to change the quantity of the cart. Okay. Also regarding this, when the user press on the checkout, it will take him to this page. In our application, I didn't make it like that. Okay, I didn't cover the uh, address because I consider it advanced and uh, or expert level even. When I explain it later on in the expert course, you will see why I made it um, in a separated course. Okay, so um, in here, as you can see, we manage uh, the checkout, the payment uh, method, for example. I'm not sure if I will cover payment methods, but in here, the user can choose any other payment method, let's say. But regarding the address here, as you can see, the user can add a new address and he can see his addresses in here like that. If I add in a new address, this page will appear like that. And if I press here, or on this button, it will be like that and the user can edit his others. Okay. In here, the profile page, it is the same as our application. And for the orders, as I showed you, we have it like that. Okay. Now let's come back. And uh, everything else is the same as uh, the final output of our application. Here we have the login and uh, sign up page which is also the same as what uh, I explained to you in this uh, tutorial 
So as you can see, it has more features, this application, which is very, very advanced features. So this is why I will make a separate tutorial for it. And um, if you want this exact design, what you need to do is to send a message for this page. And um, we, as I said, we are selling the license for it. Okay, so just that's it for this tutorial. Thank you for attending. See you on the next one.